Well, those who enjoy gazing at the nighttime sky will be excited to hear multiple planets will be visible for the next several weeks. WRTV's Macy Tetrick visited the Holcomb Observatory and Planetarium at Butler University and provides this planetary preview. I like to use the term planetary parade uh, because it's a moment where all the planets appear to be lined up in the sky in the early evening um, from here in Indianapolis. Dr. Aaron Shaw loves astronomy and the planets. The fact that you can go outside and look at a distant world and see it with your naked eye. He is very excited for what's happening in our sky, even if you don't have Indiana's largest telescope. You should be able to see Mars, you should be able to see Venus, Saturn and Jupiter. Those are four of the brighter planets. If you have a small telescope or some binoculars, you might also be able to see Uranus and Neptune as well, but they're a little tougher to see. While this event is not all that rare, the timing is different. All of these planets, the four bright ones that I mentioned especially, are at, at a, visible at an accessible time. You can go out at 7 p.m. and you'll be able to see all of these planets rather than waiting until, say, 1 o'clock in the morning. Dr. Shaw says you don't have to be an astronomer to find the planets. There are several apps that will help you identify them. Look towards the, the west after sunset and just look just above where the sun is set, you'll see Saturn and Venus easily. And on the opposite side in the east, you'll see that Mars has just risen. And then towards the south, uh, southeast, you'll see um, Jupiter as well. The planets will be visible for several weeks. And in late February, with a telescope, you may be able to see Mercury too. Just take it all in, right? Um, once you notice one really, really bright planet, you'll start to notice even more of them. Macy Tetrick, WRTV. Well, you can view the planets at your own home as well. Yeah, but for an out-of-this-world view, the Holcomb Observatory will be open this Friday and Saturday evenings for planetarium shows and a look at the planets through that massive telescope that Macy showed you in her story.